In this video, I'm gonna share with you how you can use the Aneros Prostate Massager as a biofeedback internal therapy tool, a pleasure toy, etc. Before we get into the details, I'd like to go over some quick anatomy points. Here's your pelvis. These are your butt bones. That's the anus, that's the base of the penis. Inside of the pelvis, you're gonna see your bladder that is sit sits nestled right behind the pubic bone. If I were to take out the bladder to show you the organs, here's the bladder and here's your prostate sitting right underneath the bladder. Now, if we were to look behind the prostate, you will notice uh, two structures here called the seminal vesicles. The seminal vesicles are organs that house certain specialized fluids that help protect sperm when you ejaculate. This is the penile urethra, so this is the part of the urethra that is the, goes into the extension of your penis. Now when using a Neros, anatomically, you would insert this into the anus, the rectum, and as you do so, it will sit nestled up against the back of the prostate. So how do I instruct people, or why do I instruct people to use an Eros or try it out if you have pelvic pain. So it's advertised as a prostate massager and it is advertised as a sex toy, which is great if you have a prostate and it feels good to stimulate your prostate. If you're experiencing pelvic pain, in the literature, it's really inconclusive. So we're really not sure how beneficial, if at all beneficial, it is to do prostate massage or milking of your prostate. Now that being said, I know the literature isn't entirely supportive of prostate massage, but there are a handful of individuals who find stimulation or therapy around their prostate to be pain relieving. And so if you are one of these individuals, then perhaps using a tool like a Neros would be helpful for you as far as finding some pain relief. Another way that I like to use a Neros or have or instruct people to use it is, is like a hands-free biofeedback tool. So if tolerated, and of course under the guidance of a qualified practitioner, if tolerated and feels comfortable, you can use a tool like this instead of the wand or a wand that you have to hold to do internal therapy. With the Aneros or a tool similar to this, it's hands-free so you can insert it and then just focus on your body awareness, your breath awareness, and pelvic specific exercises. Another thing I'd like to note as far as anatomy points, your prostate has a network of nerves surrounding it. Those nerves give rise to the cavernosal nerve of your penis. Those nerves are really important for sexual function. So this may be one of the reasons why someone finds prostate stimulation to be very arousing and pleasurable. So going back to specific exercises using Aneros. So you'd insert Aneros into the anus, into the rectum, comfortably inserting it up to the point where you're feeling a little bit of pushback towards the prostate. This point here is going to be nestled at the area colloquially um, known as the taint area. And this backside is going to be touching um, the area of the tailbone. Now, for feedback, what you can do is once you insert a neuros, you can just breathe deeply in and out into your abdomen and down to the pelvic floor. Your muscles, when you're breathing in and out, so taking a deep breath in, it's like a flexible trampoline. So these muscles gently expand and as you breathe out, come back up. With the Aneros device inserted, that also moves with your breath. So that's like a natural massage mechanism just with your breath, with or without the Aneros. Now, if you wanted to add a little bit of, a little bit more 
feedback or intentional and purposeful use of your pelvic floor muscles with the aneros, what you can do is then as you breathe out, you can squeeze the muscles around your pelvic floor and release. So breathing in, letting go, breathing out, squeezing and contracting. And that also is going to rock the aneros forward, tip it forward to touch the prostate gently and then relax. So this can both be a nice feedback for pelvic specific coordination exercises. It's hands-free, you can do it in different positions if you want. And it can also be fun and pleasurable for those of you who really enjoy prostate massage and want to add a different experience to your sexual repertoire. Thanks so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe and hit the like button below. This will help other guys in your situation also find these resources sooner than later. If you're a penis owner who's currently struggling with pelvic pain, you're not alone. Check out the Men's DIY Pelvic Pain Relief Program. The link is in the description below.